If you left your car parked outside overnight, it probably looked like the ones behind me when you woke up. We did speak with one Chicago car mechanic who says while the snow burial won't cause major damage, he says there are still a few things you'll want to know before you dig out and drive off. This the Chicago winter workout, digging out more than a foot of snow from overnight. A closer look at these feet tall mounds of snow reveals cars buried underneath. Drivers this morning and throughout the day scraping and shoveling to resurrect their vehicles from their snow graves. A lot of work and uh, we look forward to doing this every couple of years, uh, hopefully every couple of years and not a couple of times a year. For some drivers, digging out their cars has been a repeat performance with back to back snowstorms, while others appear to wait it out. But what will that mean for their cars? It's not going to do any damage. It's not already there. Once you get it started, just bring it by. We can look at that on the fly. Jack Gordon with Ashland Tire and Auto says heaps of snow covering your car won't cause permanent damage, but can still keep you from driving away from your parking spot quicker than you'd like. A couple things that probably are going to be a problem is that the battery is probably going to be dead when you get it out of there. Uh, the brakes are probably going to be very rusty. But what if you can't even get out of your garage? I came in last night and it was totally fine, but this was all just from in the middle of the night. The alleyway behind Caroline Knorr's home is completely impassable. In a nightmare is a, a good word for it for sure. It's just pure ice and as you can see, there's really nowhere to put the snow. The city streets and sanitation department says plowing alleyways is not a safe option, but there is a plan to make sure vehicles can get through. We do not plow alleys, which makes it difficult. I know that we will start tracking those alleys with our refuse trucks. We start plowing in alleyways, you end up co collapsing garage doors. But with the main roads and residential streets still impacted, trash collection and alleyway tracking will have to wait a little longer. As you can see behind me, these alleyways in the north side still pretty much packed with snow. Now to be clear, streets and sanitation will not be plowing the alleyways. Rather, they'll be using their collection trucks to drive through to create tracks to make them more passable for other vehicles. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.